What's going on, everybody? My name is Mason Foles, one of the winners in winers.com, expert handicappers, here today on January 8th, 2023, with another free pig video. Happy Sunday to everyone. Hope you guys are having a great weekend and ready to end it strong. And most importantly, I hope you're ready for another pick today. Like I said yesterday, buddy's wedding, still very busy, but I've locked in for these picks as I am so excited about this slate of games. Hoping our Jags minus six and a half pick worked out for us yesterday as uh, I'm just looking to continuously land in the green. Now, if you guys could please like, subscribe, hit that bell, comment to tell me what you're betting on or what you want to see, and I'll keep cranking these videos out for you guys. I appreciate your interaction so much. There's been a few of you who have been nailing it with your picks over the last few days, killing the college basketball season. So keep those picks coming in. I'll be making sure to respond to you as quickly as I can. Also wanted to give you guys a reminder that... Uh, if you guys can get this video to 75, 80 likes before the first NFL game, I'll be posting my free touchdown score parlay. Might just do a uh, few player props as the touchdown parlays haven't been going as great, but I've uh, been doing solid with the props. I'll be looking to attack with that. So make sure to head over to the main winners and winners Twitter page and my Twitter page to hop on that parlay. Now, I also wanted to remind you guys that this video is still sponsored by No House Advantage, the daily fantasy sports app where you can win over or under on player prop totals. With the chance to take down the book, you could win up to 21 times your money. This app is super easy to use, super fun. So I'm going to put a link in the description along with the promo code so you guys can pick that up and get started today. Now, with my free pick, I'm looking to attack this Sunday. As I like the Pittsburgh Steelers. I got this pick at minus 2.5 at minus 110 against the Cleveland Browns. Now, the Browns offense, they looked all right last week against the Washington Commanders, but I'm really not buying it as uh, I think they're going to end the season on a poor note as uh, they're averaging the 22nd most pass yards per game, the sixth most rushing as uh, they just haven't been able to consistently move the ball through the air this season. Deshaun Watson hasn't rep really impressed me in his return. And uh, I just see the Browns making Cleveland mistakes and losing this game. The Pittsburgh defense is also legit. They've been playing great as of late as uh, they're allowing the 11th least amount of points per game in the sixth least amount of rush yards is they're going to load the box and do everything they can to stop Nick Chubb and Kareem Hunt. They're not going to allow the, the uh, Browns to consistently move the ball on the ground, and they're going to force Watson to beat them through the air. I just don't see that happening. They're also allowing the 14th least amount of total yards as uh, they've been playing great, like I said, and uh, I see them playing great at home again in this game to end the season. Now, Pittsburgh... They need this game, and so does Mike Tomlin. This is one of the main reasons I love this pick, as uh, Mike Tomlin's actually never had a losing season as the Steelers' head coach. Well, they currently sit at 8-8, eight and eight, as it all comes down to this game. And I just don't see the Steelers losing to the Browns in this fashion. The uh, the Steelers, they're averaging the 17th most rush yards, and uh, they're turning, into, turning this game into a grinded-out game, so it's going to be a little bit more low-scoring. But uh, Kenny Pickett's been growing up. He's made some big plays, had a few big drives over the last two weeks. And I see him coming into this game with a ton of confidence. They're also running for the 17th most rush yards per game. This stat is actually up a bunch as uh, they were really not moving the ball in the be beginning of the season. But now they're starting to run it pretty well. And uh, this Cleveland defense does not work well against the uh, run. So they're actually giving up the 18th most points per game in the 25th most rush yards. As I see them uh, trying to stop Najee Harris and continuing to fail as he's going to have a big game and Pickett's going to make just enough throws to win this game outright by at least a field goal as I love the Steelers in this game. They're my favorite pick of the day so far and uh, I'm just ready to rock with this one. So don't be afraid to take the Steelers at minus two and a half. I got this pick at minus 110 and I will see all of you back in the green. I'd also love it if you guys could check out my best bet today. Today, it is in the Lions versus Packers game on Sunday Night Football, as I've picked a side in this one. So if you guys need a consistent winner, don't be afraid to hop on that pick. I'll also have my NFL pick-me-up three-pack available. So that's cashed the last week, two weeks, I believe. Two out of the three. And uh, it's been rolling. I really like these NFL games today. If you guys need some consistent winners or to build up that bankroll, don't be afraid to hop on this pick-me-up three-pack. My best bets included. Those are my three favorite picks of the day, as if they don't go two and one or better, you'll get your money back. So don't be afraid to do that. Also, don't be afraid to use my promo code. I'll take some money off the top for you guys. That code is MAS9P3F50, and all you need at the end of checkout to take some money off the top before we win some more. My final reminders, don't forget about those long-term subscriptions. I know it's really fun to hop on those best bets every once in a while, but I'm telling you the most consistent way to win with me is to hop on those premium picks. Handicapping in all sports, we've been killing it since the summer, 
and uh, we're looking to turn this into a great winner. Had a rough uh, day on uh, Thursday, I believe it was, but hey, or Wednesday night was the rough one, as uh, we're looking to get over that. We've forgotten about it, and uh, we're coming back strong, so don't be afraid to hop on any of those picks, and let's end the weekend strong. I'd also love it if you guys could head over to the Winners and Winners main titter, Twitter account, it's where you can find those free parlays and a bunch of our free picks, and uh, we've been tweeting a lot more, just trying to get involved, trying to get the word out there, so give us a follow over there. We'll look to carry you to the green. So thank you guys so much for coming and checking out this video. If you guys could make sure you like, comment, and subscribe so you can come back tomorrow and catch another free pick and have a great day.